What's up, Pisces gang? Thank you guys so much for joining me today. Thank you so much for clicking on this video. If this is your first time here, welcome. I am Quisha here with Abundant Healing. I was sent here from the universe to give you guys some good messages, some good love, some good readings, and some good vibes, and much, much more. I was sent here to give you all of that, and that's exactly what I'm doing. So thank you so much for joining me today. We are doing your daily money reading, honey. We do these every day over here at the Millionaire Pisces Club. So if you want to be a part of this journey, I would advise you to hit the subscribe button because I'm giving you channel messages um, on how you can become more abundant and attract more money and be more successful, okay? So if you would like to do that, you want to receive these channel messages, then go ahead and hit that subscribe button, honey, okay? Also, hit that notification bell. That way you'll be notified every time I drop. Yes, ma'am. Remember to like, comment, subscribe if anything resonates with you guys. If you want to support the channel, if you want to go ahead and invest, Valentine's Day is around the way. So if you want to invest into your self-love journey, I do have a self-love mystery box available for you guys to purchase. The link is in the description. Thank you guys for all of the purchases from the ones who really, you know, rock with your girl. I really appreciate y'all. I really do. I really, really do. Okay. So yeah, go on and get you one, honey. And just shop abundantheamleshops.com. You know, we got jewelry made from genuine crystals. We have regular stones or just uh, loose stones that you can purchase as well. So um, go ahead on over there and get you some, all right? We have bracelets like this too. But okay, let me jump into your reading, honey. <laughs> Universe, what messages do you have for me to give to the people Pisces collective today in regards to money? In regards to their finances, in regards to their income, in regards to their jobs, in regards to their careers, in regards to their success. What messages can I give the beautiful, the lovely Pisces today? Thank you so much, Universe. Please bring in the most relevant messages for the Pisces collected today. I'm going to get something to shuffle my cards on because I've been getting a lot of you guys saying that when I do this, it's too loud. So I have something coming for that. Just for you, honey. Just for you. I heard that. I read my comments so I know what you guys are suggesting and I look I try to accommodate you when you tell me that something is bothering you or you need something now if it's not too serious you know like I could definitely put something over this so you don't have to hear me do that all the time so universe what messages can I give the beautiful Pisces collective today in regards to money what messages can I give the Pisces collective today what advice can I give the Pisces collective today, Universe? Thank you so much. Okay, the Emperor is there again. In the Five of Wands, showing up at the bottom. Page of Wands, Tower. We have the Queen of Swords, the Devil, and the Page of Cups. So, what I'm getting is somebody, somebody here recently just like, I feel like you gave up on a job. Like you, you didn't really like the people that you were working with because I feel like you were, you were working with uh, multiple people and it seemed like there was a conflict of interest you guys were always combating with each other and you just probably didn't get along with this group of people um showing up here in your recent past Pisces you have the three of swords the three of swords is um signifying that there was some type of hurt that you endured some type of pain um Maybe you felt like someone that you was working with or someone that you were doing business with um, was not truthful and maybe they betrayed you in some type of way. But I feel like, you know, you use that moment to empower you. I feel like you use that moment, um, that time, that pain. I feel like you... Um, you took that and you 
what's the word I'm looking for? It's like you you put that energy towards something else. Like you didn't like yeah, you you got your feelings hurt, you know, like I said, maybe you either abandoned your job, maybe you even left your job, you know, maybe you got fired, maybe you used to work with a group of people and you guys kind of just always bumped heads so you had to go your way, you had to part. Maybe somebody was being uh conniving, maybe somebody was doing something behind your back. Um, or maybe somebody just really did you wrong, you know what I'm saying? Like in the, in a way to where it, it ain't no coming back from that. You know, like sometimes Pisces, when we get hurt, when people hurt us, after we have healed from the situation, it's over. Like we're not going back. Like it's, it's a wrap. Like, and, and those people who we were dealing with at that time, I mean, we may not hate them. You know, we are always good hearted people and we're always going to have, you know, love and compassion for others. But, you know, you you probably won't be um you probably won't be cool with them like how you was before you know you probably won't interact with them on a level that you did in the past but you can probably still be cordial and forgive them for what they've done but that does that doesn't mean that you have forgot you know what they've done so not to say that you're gonna hold on to it but it's just like you know fool me once shame on me fool me can't be fooled again so that's where you're at with it, Pisces. And I feel like a lot of times when we go through situations that hurt and it's painful, they really um, build us. It builds character and it builds us up to be strong, you know. And then it also kind of gives us gives us um, some energy that we can um, focus towards other places. You know what I'm saying? Because when you are hurt, when somebody hurts you, it's like you. You have you build up a lot of energy, and sometimes it turns into anger, right? Now you're angry. Now you want to get revenge. Okay, instead of letting that energy turn into anger, focus that energy on something else. Like you know, when you're trying to get over something that you've been through, like if you lost a job, if you lost a friend, or if you lost multiple friends, you know, um, you know, you don't want to think about it too much. You don't want to sit and, and I mean, it's okay to cry. It's okay to let your emotions come out. That's totally fine. I would recommend that. Um, you know, but once you're done with, you know, crying and letting that out, you know, you then use that energy that you're going to have build up, use that energy to something powerful, positive. You know what I'm saying? Like, like use the energy and just go hard at work focus on whatever you dream you know like you know if, if it's a business like if you, if you were if you were in a partnership with somebody as far as a business go focus on building your own business and and you know creating wealth for your own self building your own foundation okay you got the emperor showing up here pisces and your current moment the emperor is a very very powerful masculine card so this could either be you um this this could either be you in this position excuse me y'all <laughs> this could either be you in this position um or this could be someone that you're looking up to this could be someone who you want to um who you admire but i feel like but what I'm feeling, though, is that coming from this Three of Swords um, in your recent past and now in your current moment, this Emperor, I feel like that you did use that energy to put towards something else, like your job, your career, your success. You know what I'm saying? Like, I know Beyonce, there's a line that she say in one of her songs that say, um, always stay gracious. The best revenge is your paper. You know what I'm saying? Like, just remain humble and remain grateful. Do not allow anybody to take you off of your, um, you know, take you off of your game or to 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 demise your character or to just make you stoop down to their level. Don't allow anybody to make you do that. You know, the best revenge that you're going to have is focusing on your career and getting money and being successful. Okay, and I feel like that's kind of where you're at right now. I feel like whoever hurt you or whatever happened in the past, you, you know, you hurt, you cried, but then you got up from there 
and you moved on because you understand that sometimes pain brings um sometimes pain brings the healing that we need in order for us to have that fire under our butt so that we can be successful you know what i'm saying like reach new heights now our goals are you know higher and and the, and the fact that they are higher is making us even more um ambitious ambitious on achieving those goals because this emperor card is saying that you are very strategic you have a lot of um stability you know like you know exactly what you want to do you have a plan pisces and you're seeing this plan through you are doing something every single day to see this plan through this could be you in the position of you know a boss you know what i'm saying like you're a boss or you could be a teacher you could be a guru of some sort you know but i feel like you took those those lessons that you that you learned from in the past and you use those lessons to help you build yourself up to be like boss like like this is boss energy right here the emperor is boss energy you know what i'm saying like it's it's like self made you know but at the same time it's structured you know it 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 it, it has like a certain routine, like somebody here is bossy, you know, but not in a bad way, in a way to, in a way, in a way that you know how to make money, you know how to make money work for you. It's like, you don't, after going through this, whatever, you know, um, separation, breakup, whatever it is from your job, your, your coworkers or your business partner, whatever they had, whatever happened in the past. They, sh man, that right there fueled you into becoming a very self-made millionaire. Okay. Now showing up here in your most, in your uh, near future Pisces, you have the four of cups. The four of cups is definitely signifying foundation. So you are building a solid foundation. This foundation. Oh, wait. Oh, I didn't even, I just caught that. This, this, there are two fours here. Y'all see that? Four, four. Okay. So if you're someone who be seeing the number angel four, 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 the angels are definitely saying that you are always protected and we are guiding you. Not only that, but you are creating a very solid and stable foundation for financial security and financial um, stability. Okay. But what the four cups is also saying, Pisces, is, you know, it's okay to go within, you know, it's okay to go within yourself and just kind of just, because I feel like coming from that three of swords, you, you're not allowing anybody else to, like, you're not allowing yourself to be vulnerable anymore. Like, you got the emperor here, and that means that you have literally built yourself up, like, you're not, you're not allowing yourself to be vulnerable so that somebody can take advantage of you. Like that hurt that you felt, like you remember that and you're not allowing, nobody else will ever get the opportunity to play you like that again. So you are literally just focused on yourself. You got your eyes closed. You literally are just in your own zone. You're working in your own zone. You're not really focused on the outside world. You're just focused on yourself and achieving your goals for yourself. And you're not listening to what nobody else got to say. You know, whatever, you're not listening to nobody else's opinion. Okay, because you're focused on yourself. You're focused on your inner worlds. Because you had to heal from that situation. So now that you are healed from the situation, your focus, your, your focus is is within. I feel like everything that you was putting out now that you were giving to others, now you're giving it to yourself and you're not even seeing the world around you. But one advice that I can give you um, is that don't miss your blessings um, don't block your blessings. Don't block out your blessings because that's what's going on with the four of uh, cups because this is a very solid foundation that you have that you built, you know, financially. You do have financial security. You have financial stability. But don't shut yourself out from the world. Don't shut yourself out from others, you know, because there could be potential um, growth 
when you meet someone else, you know, you can meet another person and you don't have to go into this next relationship or this next partnership or this next job um, with the same, like, you don't have to, you don't have to use that fear of being hurt. You, you know, because if you, if you are moving through life by fearing of being hurt, then you won't be able to live to your fullest potential. So you have to be fearless, okay? I know they they did whatever they had to do. They, not whatever they had to do, but they did your wrong Pisces. And, you know, you suffered a little heartache or whatever from it. But you build yourself up to be very solid and very firm and very, like, you're not letting nobody else play you. You're not letting nobody else tell you about your position, especially when it comes to your money. Like, you know exactly what you need to do, honey. And you're not letting anybody play you when it comes to your money and your job and your career. But also, Pisces, you do want to make sure that you are being open because if you see this posture i keep on putting this in y'all face but i want y'all to understand what this four of cups is saying if you see her posture her posture is she has her arms folded that posture is is giving i don't want to be bothered that posture is giving that i'm closed off okay so what the universe wants you to know pisces is to be more open okay yeah you did heal from that hurt but don't let that hurt stop your blessing don't let that hurt block your blessings from other things that could potentially help you grow and potentially put your business at an all-time high okay or just help you spiritually as well okay help you emotionally trust your instincts trust your instincts and your intuition when you're meeting new people don't trust because sometimes you know you want to use your mind and say nah i can't trust you because i done been you know i done been burned in the past so i can't you know you use your use your Use your intuition, because I'm going to say use your heart, but sometimes your heart, baby, can lead you in the wrong direction. So I'm going to say use your intuition. Your intuition is never going to steer you wrong. So use your intuition to help you feel these people out, to help you know who is right and who is not, to help you know who has your best interest and who don't have your best interest. But baby, other than that, you, 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 baby, the way you bounce back from that heartache is, is wonderful. It's amazing. It's totally amazing, Pisces. And I love to see that you bounce back from that. Because sometimes people don't get to get up from that. But you did. Okay? And that's beautiful. And you are building a solid foundation. And you have the support from the angels and the spirit world, honey. So whatever you need, Pisces, don't be afraid to ask them. Okay? They can they can help you with anything that you may need. And that's what the 4-4 is saying. Okay? That is what I have for you guys. Thank you guys so much for joining me today. Thank you so much for watching this video. I really appreciate you. Remember to like, comment, subscribe if anything in this message resonates with you. I would really gladly appreciate it. Leave me a comment. Let me know what resonates with you or if something resonates with you. If not, then continue to watch my videos because I make them every day and you will probably find a video that resonates with you. So stay tuned okay honey also if you want to support the channel the link is in the description box of healingshops.com head on over there get you some crystals and start raising your vibration girl all right y'all i am outie 3000 that was lame but i'm out y'all i love you guys so much and i hope you're having a beautiful day bye